On Friday, The Addams Family, a musical comedy with music and lyrics written by Andrew Lippa, opens in Archer Auditorium at Ashland High School. The show features 10 main characters, 12 when you add a hand named Thing, and a ball of fur named Cousin It. The Ashland High School musical tradition dates back to 1956. Senior Andy Roblin, who plays Gomez, is excited about his first male lead role. It feels like a giant responsibility, um, but something that I've just been waiting for for a long time. So, and it's finally my turn, and I like that a lot. For Catherine Stefaniak, a senior playing the female lead, Morticia is a big step from her role as a chorus member last year. It feels really cool. Like, it's definitely something new that I've never experienced, but I've been having so much fun being Morticia. Senior Sammy Steinhauser plays Alice, a typical bored middle-class housewife who welcomes her somewhat awkward role. I, this is going to sound rude, but Alice is kind of really annoying in the first half of the show, and part of me loves that. I'm the younger sibling in my family, so being annoying is like kind of my thing. So I just love that I get to really pull that in with Alice. <laughs> Costume designer Jenna Steiner is used to a more colorful approach in her previous four musicals, but she embraced the challenge. It was uh, a lot of a lot more complex, but it was it's really fun. Um, you've got uh, all the ancestors are from different eras and times. So we have cavemen and gladiators and a mermaid, all the way up to a disco queen um, and like a poodle skirt, like fifties bobby soxer. So it's it's pretty cool to have that wide of a range, but it definitely takes a lot more work when you're pulling from a bunch of different places instead of just one similar aesthetic. Sophomore Jacob Slade does bring a little color in his role as Lucas, the boy next door or Wednesday's lover boy, in spite of her creepy family. Yeah, they're uh, like one normal night. They're not, they're not normal like the Beineke's and Lucas are supposed to be. And uh, yeah, it's a little, it's a little uh, hard for, for Lucas to sort of wrap his head around that. But yeah, I mean, he really loves Wednesday, so. Speaking of Wednesday, sophomore Megan Harrison will star in her first musical at Ashland High School. It feels really cool, especially because I'm going into a performance where majority of everybody has done it before. It's like I can ask people questions if, I, if I'm like confused on what's going on, and it's just good to have a lot of friends that can help me throughout this process. The opposite of Megan, senior Cooper Sanders, finds himself in the pit after four years of helping in various roles. It's been fun because I've been in the, the lighting booth and then cameras for three years before I went to the pit. Another senior, Emma Packard, leads a tech crew of close to 50 students. She truly enjoys working with so much talent. It's a lot of fun. I get to work with a lot of people I've seen before in past years, which is nice. And I get to drag other people into it um, and get them to love the backstage. Longtime producer Rich Wazowski knows this year's show will be an audience favorite. I'm going to be very honest with you. I initially said, oh, 10 named characters, maybe 15 ancestors. We'll have a nice small show compared to Newsies because with Newsy, Newsies was huge and we needed to do that after COVID and stuff. We wanted to come back. Well, between the talent that we had and the dancing needs, the singing needs, all of a sudden, you know, we have 35 in the ensemble, which is great. They're fantastic. And please watch. Each ensemble member is a unique character. You won't want to miss The Adams Family starring Catherine Stefaniak as Morticia and Andy Roblin as Gomez. Friday at 7 o'clock, Archer Auditorium again on Saturday at 7 and then on Sunday at 2. You can purchase tickets by calling the main office at Ashland High School 419-289-7968. Dan Chandler reporting for Ashland County Pictures.